All right, Pokemon needs no introductions. We're playing Red, the fir first of two games that came out, and yeah, we're just gonna jump right into this. We're starting a new game. I should have checked the options. Look, it's Professor Oak. Oh, look at this text. I am Professor Oak. Oh, look, Pokemon. Yeah. For some people, they're pets. Other, they're for battles. Myself, I study them because I am a professor. What is your name? I am this guy. Boop. And, yeah, okay. Select does that. I am me. Right, so you are you. This is my grandson. He's been your rival since you were a baby. I don't remember his name. You know, we'll just be generic and boring. Because I don't really have a rival. <laughs> That's right. I remember now. His name is Blue. You. Very old book in the League of Falls. Legend. I can read. Let's go. Okay. First things first. Make this fast. Make... We'll leave that on. I do like to do set, just for the extra challenge. We're going to do set. Take my potion. So yeah, for those, for those that don't know, which I feel like would be shocking, um, in this game, you only, I forget how many, uh, how many items are you're limited to, but you only have one bag, no pockets, it's just one big bag. I want to say it's like 20 items you can hold. I'm fed up of waiting, let me think. Oh, that's right, I told you to come. Uh, here, take, take one of these three. I was a trainer back in my youth. So obviously the best Pokemon to get is Bulbasaur. I did start, when I first played this game, I started off with Charmander, because I didn't know better. And it's the, it's red, it's a, it looked like the thing on the cover. So that was my choice. I like Squirtle. And obviously I think Bulbasaur is probably the best starter in this game. But we're not, we're, we're not, we're going to go with Squirtle. I probably should have, I should have done with Charmander, just be like, hey, nostalgic. Uh, we are going to name them, I don't know what to name these. Here, we'll go just call you Turt. I didn't think this I didn't think this through. Hey, let's battle. So yeah, you pick your Pokemon, you get your first battle. Your rival. Oh, pick the weakness of or the strength the stronger type against you. That's what I wanted to say. Just keep on tackling. Just keep on tackling. He's going to growl me. I should do a tail whip. I really do like all three of these Pokemon. The Char Charizard, Blastoise, Venusaur. And it's kind of cool that they all got Megas, although Charizard somehow ended up with two, which, yay, popularity, whoopity. Funny enough, I used the other two more than Charizard. Actually, I think I used Mega Venusaur the most out of the three, but I did Blastoise. I made, I trained uh, Blastoise first just because I, I really like the design. I picked the wrong Pokemon. Yeah, pick Char with Charmander. Smagulator. We could get a map in there. 
Actually, I think it's after. Our first wild encounter is a tooth. Here, let's beat it up. So I will try to... <laughs> Ironic. I'm going to try to put grinding to a minimum. On the videos, at least. Even though it's, it's in my channel name. Uh, free potion. Let's grab the free... Get, 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 give me a potion. I know, I'll give you a sample. Potion! Yay, free potion. It... So yeah. Just gotta do our normal beginning stuff in this game. It's a pity. Let's beat it up. You know, Pokemon's great. That was a crit, jeez. To be fair, we do want to get a water move for Brock. If we can get a Pikachu in Meridian Forest, Meridian Forest, that'd be great. But I'm not going to hunt down a Pikachu. Because it's pretty rare. Alright. We got our Professor Oak's item, because he's too lazy to... Oh, there's the door. Because he's too lazy to go here. Hey, you! You know Professor Oak? Hey, give this to him. One thing I do hate about this is that you come here. You can't buy Pokeballs yet. So you have to go to this town. Deliver the item back. And then you have to buy the Pokeballs. I do like it in the later games where they're like, here, have some Pokeballs. Did Gold? I think, I think Gold and Silver started that. Like, once you, once you head back, there's the guy in the wild. Like, there's the guy outside the roots. It's like, here, I'm going to teach you how to catch a Pokemon. Have some, po here, have some balls. Although I guess this game also teaches you later, like you get your Pokeballs first and then there's the guy in the road who's like, I can't move unless I teach you how to catch. Oh, you, you seem well, uh, you're talented. Oh, you yeah, have something for me. Ah, this custom thing. Why'd you call me for? Oh, I have a quest for you to. I want you to do my work. I have these devices that let you track Pokemon. I need you to do it, use them. For science! Find all the Pokemon. So I'm going to give Pokemon some credit. In a marketing standpoint. That they divided all the Pokemon between the two games. And they've been doing that ever since. I mean, it sucks, but it's also smart. So yeah, you could have gotten a map for free right there, but I'm not going to need it because map is for the week. That's a level four Pidgey. I'm actually going to, yeah. Because I'm pretty sure that Pidgey would probably kick my ass unless I use a potion. And I don't want to waste a potion just yet. So, I'm going to beat up on this Rattat. I think Red is the only game that I actually done a successful Nuzlocke. Probably because I'm familiar with the game more than I was with Ruby. I'm getting low. I don't want to tempt fate. Like, I kind of understand Red's swanky mechanics. I'm not going to say I'm an expert at it, but... I know about the crit rate shenanigans and the... Um, 
some of the busted moves. I want Pokeballs. That there was a way to. I thought there was a way to like jump and jump up by ten. Now we can go this way to get some Pokemon. You know, let's let's see what we get. Let's see what our first Pokemon is going to be. We're just going to run into one and then we're going to bail. Be nice if it was a need range or not. And we'll beat it up. We'll beat it up. Ha 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 ha. Actually, we don't really need a meter in. Alright, well, we ran into our one. It was nothing exciting. I know you can run it into a manky there, but I'm not sure if it's in this version. Oh. Cat! I don't want you laying under the chair. Cat wants to lay under the chair, you know, where I like to sit and move the chair, and then I run over you. You can lay here. Here, I'll put my foot on you so you don't move. <laughs> uh, I would like a flying Pokemon, but I don't know if I want a Pidgey. Yeah, you're pretty beefy. Actually, you're not hurting as much as I thought you would. Oh, this is good experience. Also, I forgot to grab something. Hey, we got a crit. Okay, we're good. We're good. Get out of the grass. Okay. We're gonna go... We're gonna go heal up. This is kind of wasting time. But yeah, there's something here. Ah! We have three potions now. All right. We're going to go heal up and then just go into the forest. This is the last time I'll use this center until I have to come back for it. All right, so Viridian Forest. Viridian Forest, we're off to Vermilion City. Oh, wait. No, we're not. I can't believe I remember that song. I don't remember the words. Or I don't remember the lyrics, but I just remember that being a song. Alright, we're just going over here, grab an item. It's a free Pokeball! You know, all these poke Pokeballs, I'm not catching anything. On that note, I'm not even sure what I want my party to look like. Uh, you know, we'll fight you. I will be a little worried if I get poison, because... Poison sucks. I hate poison. Poison in any game, really. Yep. That's a level 6, okay. Yeah, keep doing that. Oop. Don't poison. I'm not taking a chance. Tackle can miss. Technically, technically, I think all moves can miss in this version. Because it's that weird like 90 every move is like 97 point something percent accuracy but then there's some moves that are less accuracy what i'm trying to say is you can miss with swift which is a move that never misses 
It's very rare, but... But tackling this one, I think it's like a 90... Not, not, no. It's not that. It's not... I know tackle in this game's not 100%. I actually don't remember what the accuracy is. Isn't there an item up here? Yeah. Okay, I'm, I feel good. Look at me not running into any Pokemon. I'm actually impressed. Item! We might actually beat Brock in this video. Free potion right in front of the trainer. Trainer, you have to fight. Hey, what's up? Let's fight. I have a Weedle. I have a turt. I have, I'm going to be, I, I have to say this. I really like the sound effect of Bubble Beam. Because it just sounds so cool. Or Bubble is just lame. <laughs> so we're speed tying. And there's the poison. Well, I think I'm gonna use the antidote here just so I can get out of here. For now, that's going to be really the only time I have to worry about poison. I think right now my cat's not enjoying the fact that I'm keeping him in place. <laughs> you don't like laying there? Or are you just being cute and rubbing against me? Alright, well, we're gonna go fight Brock. Our first gym leader. So yeah, like I said, when I first played this game, I started with Charm uh, Charmander. This was not an easy fight, but I'm gonna s say something that I still find shocking. When I beat Brock. Bloop, 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 bloop. Wow, that is a tanky diglet. Bloop, 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 bloop. Uh, at least it's not crew. Okay. It's a shrew! Good. I hate sand attack. Uh... Yep. I hate sand attack for a different reason. Because RNG now. RNG in an RNG RNG based game. All right, we're and I don't have another Pokemon to remove this accuracy drop. I think that's all six. Yeah, nothing happened. So yeah, that's all six 
There, there's <laughs> all six stat drops. Darn it. I'm Brock. I'm the leader. Our defenses. Rock types. They rock. Boop. Boo boop. So I should maybe one shot, maybe two shot the dude. Two shot. So I'm gonna two shot the uh, the Onyx too. I hope I two shot the Onyx. Okay, good. Cause Bide would have killed me <laughs> if I couldn't if I couldn't kill it or get the speed drop. I took you for granted, as proof, here, have my badge. It's an official Pokemon League. Bear becomes more powerful. You can now use Flash. Wait, take this. It's Bide. I'm so glad they changed the way TMs work. Because... I think... How long it took them? five generations i think that's when they changed it was the fifth generation but but yeah and also another thing that they did away with is the badges like give you a boost which i also thought was interesting but collecting more badges made you slightly stronger but yeah I'm trying to remember where I get Flash, <laughs> if I'm going to be honest. I don't remember where I find Flash. It was... You know, I don't remember. But yeah. We did a lot in the first video. We beat the first gym. We only have our one Pokemon still. We have Turt. But yeah. Oh yeah, the thing I was going to tell you. So yeah. When I... Like I said, when I started the game, when I first played the game, I started off with Charmander because, you know, box art, blah, blah, blah. So I got to Brock with Charmander. I don't remember if I had any other Pokemon at the time. I'm, I'm, I assume I did. So, but when I entered the battle, my Charmander evolved into Charmeleon. <laughs> and I was like, I didn't, at first, I thought that was the coolest thing ever because I didn't know, I was not expecting it. So I thought every time you beat uh, you're whenever so the first time I fought yeah how do I look for it like the first time like after you beat your first gym your starting Pokemon is going to evolve and I don't remember <laughs> I don't remember anything afterwards because I probably forgot about it at that point because I was young and stupid and still stupid but whatever but <laughs> I remember at that point I thought that was the coolest thing and then I it's probably when I figure when I learned that no, they evolved at certain levels. And now thinking back, it's like, how the hell did I get my Charmander up that high to evolve and fight Brock, the rock gym leader with a rock uh, with a fire Pokemon? It's like what? Uh I wish I could remember what like that run in Pacific specific, but but yeah. Anyways, yeah. That's going to be it for today's episode. We're playing Pokemon Red all the way to the end. Because why not? Let's have some fun. This is nostalgic. I enjoy Pokemon Red. And yeah. I'll see you guys in the next grind.